Welcome to another edition of Dan Frequently Asked Questions. In this case, we are asked about a diver and IPO, which is an acronym for Immersion Pulmonary Edema, or a synonym for this, Internal Drowning. This is a condition that happens sometimes in more elderly individuals who are at the verge of cardiac failure and as a result accumulate fluid in the lungs and that causes disturbance with gas movement in and out of the lungs but it can also occur in very fit individuals usually swimming or diving in cold water. The important aspect of immersion pulmonary edema is that if it has happened once it is quite possible that it will happen again and the recommendation is that one should wait at least a month before returning to diving and be checked out by a cardiologist so that they can determine whether there is a possible rhythm disturbance or a heart malfunction that predisposes the individual to this condition. There are uh, articles on Divers Alert Network's website and of course various other scientific articles that discuss immersion pulmonary edema and if you have suffered from this condition I encourage you to look them up. Very importantly you should be fit to dive and we want people to have at least a fitness level of seven to nine METs which in layman's terms means that you're able to walk virtually indefinitely at a pace of seven to nine kilometers per hour. If you're unable to do this then there's a chance that the lack of fitness may predispose you to this or there may be an underlying condition preventing you from doing so. I hope this has given you some guidance and until next time safe diving.